here is more like the person goes almost to a combat base. So what happens if she wants to go to a combat base when I'm in the butterfly guard and I have my other foot here, she's going to bring up the leg that's in front of me. On this on the opposite side that I have done. The reason for that is if she brings her leg up on the other side, it's actually a big mistake. She's leaning to the side I want to sweep, right? So normally what happens, I get my other foot, I get my underhook, I start setting up my sweep, and she posts a little closer. As soon as I see that foot come up, the knee come up, I go hand on the heel, really low on the heel, like pinky on the floor. If it's up here, it's not going to work. Hand on the heel. Again, from here, I'm going to pull kind of in the direction of her toes, to stretch her leg out, and then I bring in towards my hip. From here, we just rock up right into our combat base. And then you can start setting up your slice of passes, whatever you want. But real simple, guys, real simple. Feeling this? Feeling this? Um, you can. Like, usually when I go, it's like a quick, like yeah. boom. Okay. But yeah, if, she, if she's heavy on that leg, I can get her weight off by giving her a little pull here, or like a push back. But when I go, it's kind of like a quick start. Pinky on the floor, and kind of like bump her heel. Once the foot starts to slip forward a little bit, it's going to come out pretty quick. Can you slip it around? Yes. Again, guys, you can circle around. So again, we got our underhook, and we were setting up our position, same as before. I see the leg come up. Now, if the leg's like really far out, I'm not going to try it. Right, her leg's too far. I have to stretch way out, and then I have no leverage to, to pull there. This is more like when the leg is close. So the leg's here, it's within my range. So again, it's going to be like a quick hit on the heel, pull forward. Again, like kind of in the direction of her toes, and then I bring it into my hip once it stretches out. From here, I'm going to rock up to my knee, keep this elbow connected to the dog. Good? Yes. Is there any way you can, like, if she does push far out, is there any way you can bait her like that? Uh, if she pulls far out, I'm going to do something else. Just, just yeah, I'm not, I'm not going to like reach for it. I'm not going to try and bring her closer. There's other, there's better options. Make sense? Any other questions, guys? Once I bring the heel to my hip. It's funny with this sweep, when she falls, because I'm so close to her and I have like the underhook on the other side, when she falls, she kind of pulls me with her. If you need to, you can put your hand on the floor. But honestly, like when she falls, I'm already here, I'm just rocking up to my knee. If I'm trying to pull the heel, I don't have to. Like once her leg's straight and she and her butt hits the mat, I can I can let go of my knee. Watch them all. 